Hello guys, um, hey, welcome to what he said, and <laughs> yeah, so, um, we're going to be doing part 15 of our walkthrough for Lego Harry Potter, years 1 to 4, this is the, this is a really hard, this is a really hard level, I don't think you'll want to do it, this is, um, Tom Riddle's diary, it feels like it's the longest level, oh yeah, level. I'm gonna do it, if it has Tom Riddle in it, I'm, I'm going to do it. It has Lord Voldemort. Oops. No, Lord Moldywort. It's Mounting Mantle. Okay, Mountain now Mantle. this this is like a mini boss fight between... You and Mounting Mantle. Who, might I say, just suddenly disappears in the books. Yeah, I mean... She just suddenly disappears. Like, what? Did she die? Or what? Well, actually, she can't die. But... Exactly. What happened to her? Yeah, I mean, it's kind of weird because, um... She... The last time you saw her was... In the books, you saw her in the sixth one because she sees Harry use, um, Sectum Semper on Malfoy for the first time. And she yells, Murder, murder in the bathroom! And all that. But, you know... But then that's it. You don't see her any time after that. It is really kind of stupid. There you go, Scabbers. You go around and collect those studs now. Yeah, Scabbers is going to be like our uh, stud collector. You guys... Oh, God. He's quick. He's small. But you figure out he's evil. Oh, I realized. I, I don't know. Okay, this is gonna be kind of hard. There we go. With modern nunchuck, you have to bang it. <laughs> Not that way. Different way. Ah, oh, I keep getting hit by everything. I'm gonna use the tripping jinx. Oh, she just chucks it over oh. on. <laughs> Wait, isn't this uh Dumbledore's memory? Tom Rose memory. I've actually gotten them mixed up before. Sorry, I'm just dropping out so I can eat popcorn. <laughs> you might want to stay up for the rest of it because it gets harder. Okay. Okay. I already have five million studs. <laughs> So you're going to need a um, strength potion to get past that, so. So yeah, um, Tom Riddle has every spell. He has Expecto Patronum. He has everything. But um, when you do him in free play, then he has like a Vada Kedavra and everything. For some reason, he doesn't have those spells in story mode. So. This is in story mode, he was just a child. Oh, in his memories. He was just a little innocent child. An innocent, an innocent child founded by Dumbledore. Yeah. So anyway, um, another question that I want to ask fans is, what would be your favorite Harry Potter video game besides this? So, Nick, what about you? 
Well, considering I have the half blood prince, I'd have to say that. I haven't, e I haven't even gotten halfway done with it. It's kind of long. I don't know what I think. Um, I actually used to own all of the games, so I. And your parents made you sell them. But actually, they didn't make me sell them. They actually threw them. They actually threw them away. <laughs> you didn't try to dig them out of the trash. No, they already. They had already thrown them away. They'd already like given them up. Mm. Sad memory. How do you find the skeleton? Like, I can't find the skeleton on. Oh wait, never mind. I remember this. I remember just screwing up trying to find it one day. I just cast me on the so It's actually there. Oh, I probably wasted a few minutes. So Nick just dimmed the lights so we can see it better. But... It's kind of dark, but yeah, you can still see it. I'll be back in a minute. Okay. So, um... I think my favorite video game would have to be, I don't know, um, I like, well, I like how the games have progressed, first off, because the Sorcerer's Stone, it started out as like this, I had them all for the PC, and then I got the Half-Blood Prince, Deathly Hallows Part 1 and 2 for the Wii, which I still own, actually, I kind of gave them away. But I can still get them back, because the person I gave them away to is my friend. So, um, I can just get them back. Easily. So. Anyway, but I like how the games progress. Like, the first, second, third, they started out as this kind of just regular school people for the PC, kind of. Then the fourth one, it became, like, this really cool thing where you're just shooting jinxes at everything. The fifth one and sixth, it becomes, like, this modern, really good Hogwarts from the movies. And Deathly Hallows Part 1 and 2, it just becomes this straight-up cover shooter, so... I don't know which game I like the most. I like, um... Uh... I mean... You like them all. Yeah. It's really hard to choose the best one, because they're all so good. It's just showing up in black and white. Yeah, because that's what it's like in the game. It's black and white. It always looks like that, trust me. TV brightness is adjusting. What's oh, better? <laughs> now the uh, carrot looks like a lightsaber. <laughs> carrot one looks like a lightsaber. It's like, yeah. Oh, I just died. Who would I be, Tom Riddle? Yeah, you'd be Tom Riddle. Ooh. Well, almost, it's almost done, though. I don't care. I love being told. Alright, Casmin Garden Leviosa. On that table. Um, it's right back there. The thing that's sparking. That's the torch. Right there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Didn't even get through. You can, you can go around. Oh. Ooh, ooh, stud. Oh my god, I'm torturing a person. You're not torturing him. I wish I was. <laughs> That'd be cool. So anyway, um, I realized we haven't been talking much about us lately. I mean, um... One, we go to night from middle school. We're in the Kirkwood School District. Uh, we would be glad to know if you're a stalker or not. Mm. Fat hag. Aragog. Bye bye, Aragog. No, all he's got is an umbrella. <laughs> Actually, um, in the books, it says that um, so they snapped Hagrid's wand when he was expelled. 
but Hagrid still has the pieces in his umbrella, so he can still use magic. Oh my god, that'd be so awesome in the movie. There are so many things in this game that could have just worked into the movie. So. Okay. Well, I guess if this is the end of our 12th walkthrough. 15. 15. So, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. See you next time.